Travis Kelsey breaks his silence on Taylor Swift shouting him out in Argentina, Prince Harry and Meghan Markle might be on the road to making up with King Charles, and Real Housewives of Beverly Hills star Kyle Richards claps back after she's accused of faking her marital woes. All of this tea is coming up right now. It's Madison Hill reporting for What's Trending, and before I get into Travis Kelsey spilling the tea on how he felt about Taylor Swift showing him love on stage, and the phone call that might have changed everything for Prince Harry and Meghan Markle, let me first fill you in on the latest with Kyle Richards. Real Housewives of Beverly Hills star Kyle Richards has been busy combating rumors about the separation from her husband Mauricio Umansky after 27 years of marriage. From addressing cheating allegations to discussing her husband seemingly getting cozy with another woman, there has been a lot thrown at Richards as of late. Similar to how there has been a lot of not so nice allegations thrown at Prince Harry and Meghan Markle amid their tension with the royal family, but I'll get into how that might be changing in just a second. Now, the Bravo reality star is being accused of faking her marital troubles with Mauricio Umansky in order to help boost ratings for her Housewives franchise, an allegation that Kyle Richards is not here for at all, as she addressed it on Bravo's Hot Mic podcast with executive producer Alex Baskin. That is one of the dumbest things I've maybe ever heard in these 13 years. I'm going to pretend that I'm separated and torture my children so that people tune in. I mean, that's just the dumbest thing I've ever heard. Kyle went on to call these allegations annoying, frustrating, and she also noted that they couldn't be any more different than who she is. Okay, moving on, before I get into Travis Kelsey's reaction to Taylor Swift shouting him out during her Eras Tour performance, let's first get into this royal tea. Recently, Prince Harry and Meghan Markle made headlines for not being invited to King Charles' 75th birthday celebration across the pond. However, it doesn't appear as though these two ousted royals are holding a grudge. According to a new report from The Telegraph, Prince Harry and Meghan Markle may have had a, quote, turning point with King Charles after they called him on his actual birthday earlier this week. In addition to Prince Harry speaking to his father, The Telegraph reports that the king also spoke to Meghan and enjoyed a recording of his two grandchildren singing him happy birthday. According to the report, the conversation was, quote, warm and marked a, quote, notable shift in tone between Harry and his father. This comes after a report from Life & Style magazine earlier this week where a source shared that Prince Harry would like to move back to the UK and make a compromise with his father on how him and Meghan Markle can return to their roles in the royal family. Okay, last but not least, let's get into this Tavis update because like me, I know y'all can't get enough. As you all know, over the weekend, Taylor Swift shocked fans when she gave Travis Kelsey a shout out and changed the lyrics to her hit song, Karma. Karma is the guy on the streets. <laughs> While well, Travis's reaction after the fact was pure perfection, he's now opening up about the moment on his New Heights podcast with his brother, Jason Kelsey. Yeah, no, I had no clue. Might have had a little bit of a clue. Definitely when I heard it come out of her mouth, still shocked me. I was like, oh, sh Travis's brother went on to call him out saying that he was so shocked he didn't even return Taylor's dad's high five, something Travis made sure to apologize for publicly. And I think I speak for all Swifties when I say this moment, and of course, that iconic kiss makes us all ship Taylor and Travis that much more. All right, that's all I have for you on this episode of What's Trending Sub Scoop. Make sure to follow and subscribe to us everywhere.